Hey guys, welcome to Lighter TV. As you can see, in front of me, I have the Galaxy Note 3. As you may know, there is also a companion that Samsung is marketing, and that is the Samsung Galaxy Gear smartwatch. So the Galaxy Gear smartwatch is Samsung's very first piece of wearable technology and is also one of the few smartwatches that are available in the market right now. In front you can see there is a 1.63 inch 320 by 320 display and it's using Super AMOLED technology. Inside there is a single core 800 MHz Exynos processor with an ARM Mali 400 GPU which is actually pretty powerful. There is also 512 megabytes of RAM with 4 gigs of onboard storage. And over here you can see there is a 1.9 megapixel camera, integrated speakers and mic here. There is a 315 milliamp battery in the Galaxy Gear, which Samsung says will allow you to use it for 25 hours. And in terms of connectivity, this thing syncs with the Galaxy Note 3 or the Galaxy Note 10.1 2014 edition. There are two sensors in the Galaxy Gear. The first is a 3-axis accelerometer which actually detects when you are lifting your watch up and it shows you the time. Also, there is a gyroscope as well as gesture controls within the Galaxy Gear as you can see here. Uh, finally, this Galaxy Gear syncs with the Galaxy Note 3 using Bluetooth 4.0. So let's check out how the Galaxy Gear syncs with the Galaxy Note 3. Bundled in with every Galaxy Gear is the charging and syncing cradle. As you can see, it's here. There is micro USB for charging, while the five pins here connect the Galaxy Gear at the back, as you can see. So now we will try to sync and pair the Galaxy Gear with the Galaxy Note 3 for the first time. To do this, we will need the charging and syncing cradle that's bundled with every Galaxy Gear as well as the Gear Manager app, which is available at the Samsung App Store. And as you can see, it's asking us to pair the Cradle with the Galaxy Note. So let's try that out. So yeah, there you go. It's connecting. So as you can now see, the Galaxy Gear is now connected to the Samsung Galaxy Note 3. So with the Gear Manager app, you can customize a lot of things remotely on the Galaxy Note 3 without even touching the Galaxy Gear. You can change the face of your clocks, as well as have a look at all your installed apps on the Galaxy Gear, and even download remotely apps for the Galaxy Gear from the Samsung App Store. Finally, should you actually lose your Galaxy Gear smartwatch, you can actually try and locate it back using the Find My Gear feature on the Gear Manager app. So with a connected Galaxy Gear, I can actually sync notifications across from my phone to the Galaxy Gear smartwatch. I can also set an alarm, a new alarm, and it will also sync to my watch. There you go can dismiss it on the watch itself. All right, now let's check out the camera feature on the Galaxy Gear. So it is activated by a very simple gesture when you're on your home screen, which is the clock face, you just swipe down and you're on the camera interface. So I'll just snap a random shot of this. And to go to the gallery, it's a swipe to the right. Photos taken on the Galaxy Gear will automatically sync periodically to the Galaxy Note 3. But if you can't wait, you can actually transfer it straight to your phone. As you can see, the photo is now here. So the Galaxy Gear has a 1.9 megapixel sensor here, and it has actually quite a lot of features. You can play around with the focus modes, photo sizes, and there is the cool sound and shot feature, which is what you find on the Samsung Galaxy S4 and newer Galaxy smartphones. It's on the Gear smartwatch. One of the coolest features on the Galaxy Gear is the ability to make phone calls from the watch itself without taking out your phone. To open the dialer, all you need to do is when you're on your home screen, you swipe up and it's the dialer right here. I'm just going to dial a simple number and immediately, 
the phone will sync to the call. Obviously, I don't have a SIM card with, on the phone right now, so I can make the call. I can even end the call from the gear itself. So that's the Galaxy Gear smartwatch. All in all, I think it is a very interesting companion to the Galaxy Note 3, which is a bigger phone. It reduces the hassle of taking out a big phone such as this. Uh, every time you need to check your email, your calls or anything, the Galaxy Gear reduces that. However, one major stumbling block I think will be the price. I don't think people would pay 999 ringgit on top of the 2,399 retail price, despite the obvious uh, conveniences of the Galaxy Gear smartwatch. That being said, of course, if you can get the Galaxy Gear for free, which is being offered right now with several of the local telcos, that is a very good deal. So thanks for watching guys. Do give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed watching the Galaxy Gear smartwatch video. If you have any questions about the Galaxy Gear, do drop us a comment and we'll try our best to answer. Finally, do subscribe to Loud.TV for the latest and greatest from our channel.